So here I am again at the All Important Crossing. That's the road that goes down to what might work as a kayak launch. Often a ponds it if you wanted to get out of a canoe from somewhere else and walk around. <coughs> and this is our trail I suspect is going to connect with a maze of cross-country ski trails that'll get us back to where we have the car parked at the end of Royale Street or Road or whatever it particularly is. This is an amazing concentration of different bird species along here. The mix of ecotones seems to be doing the trick. Abundant food options. Here we are around what appears to be some bullfrogs, maybe toes. Probably about midway along this other side access road that heads out to the rest of Great Blue Hills. This might be one of the spots under consideration for a tie-in trail, and that's what we'll discover momentarily. Looks like a bicycle's been through here. And there's like a vehicle blocking rock that often indicates a border. This might be it. Alright, this is our mystery zone. We're at the end of the crossroad. We've already found a trail and it does look like it will lead into that maze of cross-country skiing trails. Something also continues here, so I may explore it briefly just to make sure there isn't a bigger trail, but I don't think there is. None of this is on the DCR maps, nor does it seem to be anywhere else. AMC might have it in a guide somewhere. And it's property of the town of Canton or something, so they don't have any information in their system. So, this doesn't really seem to go. It probably eventually leads out to Green Street in Milton or Canton. I don't know who it belongs to. So we concluded that this is most likely our option for getting into this system of cross-country ski trails that work their way down towards where the car is located on Royale Street.
we've basically now covered nearly all of the trail mysteries for the Neponset DCR Fowl Meadow property. A little subdivision of the Blue Hills Reservation. We just traversed kind of a wet section. There's some old boardwalk remnants that eventually will probably be replaced. And then we have a vernal pond with things going on. The ever-present sound of trains in the distance. We came from that direction. We're heading in that direction and the ponds at rivers over there. It's like some iris is joining the skunk couch.